Owners in one Lansing neighborhood were forced outside in the heat Wednesday. They were evacuated from their homes after a gas main break near the Genesee and Sycamore streets. Josh Dorowitz reports and was there to see how they tried to keep their cool. I'm about to pass out. A hot Wednesday afternoon for those living near Sycamore and Genesee streets in Lansing. Forced to evacuate their homes after BWL workers who were fixing a residential water main accidentally hit a gas line which brought consumers energy out to the scene shortly thereafter to shut off the gas and repair the leak. It was a two-way man that was actually uh, that was actually uh, server consumers. They came in and had to dig in both directions of the break in order to pinch it off. So it took about two hours in order for them to re re uh, mitigate that situation. It was two hours that left residents sweating it out. They had us outside with two of my little grandkids, hot, Muggy. Yeah, I'm hot too. I had a, we're, I just put off my breakfast. Luckily, my wife's at our neighbors, so, and she's diabetic. Ambulances were kept close by. A catabus was also eventually brought in for some of the residents to sit in to keep cool during the evacuation. It's always a concern when you have temperatures above 90 degrees. You always want to make sure that you take those into consideration. Immediately when we have a call like this, we might have a potential of evacuation. We typically, uh, you know, uh, coordinate with uh, CATA. Crews were able to finish up the repairs a few hours after the initial evacuation. Officials said it was a low-risk leak and that residents were never in any immediate danger, but nonetheless a hot way to spend the afternoon waiting it out. In Lansing, Josh Sidorowitz, Fox 47 News. And thankfully no one was hurt and crews were able to finish up the repairs and get gas customers in that area back online around 3.30 Wednesday afternoon.